Zana Juska here. Um, just finished the, the business show and we are celebrating an okay success. I'm here at uh, Granite with my team. It's there. And um, the reason why I'm doing this video is because um, we had some expectations for this uh, show. We put a lot of effort into organizing ourselves to, to have an amazing success and that was not really achieved. But we, we've learned some lessons and I want to share with you what we've learned and what we should have done better. So. Um, because we didn't have many people at my uh, workshop during the business show and also because we didn't have as many visitors coming to my stand, I thought we overpaid for this, we were, we were sold the, right, the wrong thing by the, the show organizers and uh, they didn't deliver so it's all their fault. And then I was thinking afterwards, actually, yes they did have oversold me but it's my fault. It's, I can't blame anybody else for my lack of, of results, really. Um, because I had a chat with one of my friends who's done loads of shows before and she told me that I need to have uh, some hooks for people to come to the, to the stand. Uh, so I, I got some loads of chocolates and, and those were good for people to come. But then we didn't know how to engage with the people which were coming to the show to get them to stay and to get them to interact with us and uh, eventually buy from us. So um, um, tip number one for you, get the hook, get the chocolates or whatever you want to offer for free, uh, whatever you do a show or, or you have a stand. And then tip number two, Organize yourself and be very, very clear with your objective. Because you see, my objective for the show was to sell. And uh, we, we don't want to work with anyone. We just want to work with those entrepreneurs who are really, really committed in building a solid business. So those people need to invest their time, they focus their energy into working with us and also building their business. So they need to, to take action with all the, the strategies and, and the tools that we provide. So we just said, okay, we want to have those five of those committed people which will work with us over a year. That was our objective for the show. And um, so we went really for the high-end ticket and getting those cherry-picked clients that are suitable for us with loads of energy, loads of drive who want to invest in their business. And uh, we couldn't get those five sales because what we realized was the business show is that People go there to browse, not necessarily to buy, and definitely not necessarily to, to sign a, a large contract. So what we, the, the biggest mistake we, we made for this show was that we didn't have the realistic objectives. Um, now, I learned after two days being there and having seen what the others did, was that we should have focused on getting leads, nothing else other than very qualified leads, and then interact with those leads further. Um, instead, we made a mistake on, on, um, of trying to sell on the spot, which is exactly what we teach our clients not to do. So we kind of fell into our own trap here. So um, uh, I hope this, this video is her serving you and um, I hope you will get some nuggets out of this. So first of all, get a hook whenever you expose your products or services in an environment where there is loads of your competitors around. Uh, so you give them something of value for, for free. And uh, secondly, um, decide on all your objectives which are realistic based on the situation that you are exposed into. And third one, which is I think the most important one, is don't blame anybody else. Because the fault is always within us, the leaders of our own businesses and our own lives. So if this video um, was helpful, if you've got any good nuggets out of this, just uh, give us a like, comment on the video below, uh, share it with your friends and um, have a great successful business. See you shortly.